What's good, y'all? This is your boy Marcus Harvey, the Barber Star, and this is Bevel Masterclass, the world famous Half Moon Part. Rock by Rakim, Nas, and all those who love hip hop music. This is the hip hop part. Let's check it out. You want to make sure that you use measuring points right off the corner, mid eyebrow, corner of the eyebrow. Today I'm gonna to be using the bevel T blade. I'm gonna start right in this middle. You always want to do it at, at an angle because if you go straight up, then your curve is gonna change. But if you come at an angle like this, it automatically starts making your shape. This section and this section. The middle, typically you don't really need it when you're doing this design. And then you just kind of gut it out using a C, a C, a half C shape. Establish your first line. It's like that stroke. This is how I do Nas's part. Set my guideline and then just meet all the traveling pieces. Boom, half moon. Now, you wanna clean that up by using your bevel blade. I like to also have a little bit of um, rise with mine, just so I can get to those corners a little bit better. Cause when it's that half moon, you're gonna have to use the edge of the blade to get that curve. The edge of this blade right in here to get that curve. The good thing with using the bevel T-blade versus other clippers when you're doing the half moon part is one, Nas wasn't rapping about the mother clippers. He's rapping about this clipper. Two, you don't have no wire at all. But let's go ahead and hit it with the razor. You wanna still go with the grain when you're doing a part so that you don't get razor irritation. And as you can tell, I'm going this way with the stroke, but as this curve changes, I'm gonna kinda of turn on this side and kind of come down on the back end of the, of the part. Finally, I'll use my V2 blade because it's shorter. You want to make it look like just a pencil did it or the width of your blade did this. And this is just me getting all those little flyaways that are overcasting on that part and not letting that part breathe. You gonna give this part some air. Give this part some air. Typically with that part, this hair's gonna kind of grow over it. So you always wanna kind of reestablish that connection of that, uh, of the lineup with that part. And using the corner of the blade. I usually like to go over the top of the cut just to smooth it out, get any flyaways out of the way so that you can really see that that part is living and breathing. This is magic out here, baby. And there you have it. I'm Marcus Harvey, the Barber Star, and this has been a Bevel Masterclass with the Half Moon Part. You too can be fresh like Nas. Why not be fresh?